looking at different things to take some product pictures on. I thought these were really cute. All the flowers, they're here, and Regina. <laughs> All of it is so cute. Look, they have little journals too. Sorry. <laughs> what did you find, friend? What did you find? Oh, it's an LED flower. Oh, so cute! Oh, so cute. It was a ginger and bergamot. It's delicious. So cute. Oh my god, like, it's really I took you with me to the 99 cent store in the Dollar Tree but I didn't really show you what I got um, and I also got some stuff in uh, for the reopening of my shop um, on August 1st so I wanted to show it all to you all together so I'm gonna go ahead and insert that here I'm gonna leave the sound on because there's some pretty pleasing ASMR with um, some of the bags but I'm also gonna run some music in the background so enjoy so the first thing that I guess I'll show you the stuff from my shop first um, the first thing that I got was these fawn dips. I got them from Amazon and they have, um, I think they have Raz Apple Magic and Cherry Yum Diddly. Delicious. Um, I like when I'm packaging. So when I get stuff in the mail, I like for there to be like little extras in it or like 
just something that's like really cute, something that sends it like over. So I decided that I was going to add um, a little treat with the packages that I sent out when I or sent out when I reopened my store in August. Um, and I also got like some confettis and some glitter and just stuff like that that makes it really cute and I guess memorable so I like everybody when they order something to feel like they have a present coming to themselves and so this kind of sends like the unexpected um part of it into it also so anyways fun dip a box of fun dip that's one thing that I got um I actually got this little container at the 99 cent store when we went because I knew that I needed a container for some of the candy that I got not all of them came in their own box like fun dip did so I wanted to have a container where I could keep them all the other um candy that I did get was these little chupa chup uh, lollipops I got the strawberry and cream and chocolate and cream flavor pack um and I tried them myself they're delicious so I got those to put in some orders too. Oops. I saw these at the Dollar Tree and I had them in my cart, but I didn't end up getting them because I had too many things already. And it was just something that like, I know that I kind of will need down the road, but I didn't need right that second. So I was like, okay haggling with myself at the Dollar Tree, whatever. But anyways, um, Regina had already gotten them, and so she had an extra one, and she gave it to me, and that was really sweet of her, because I really love these. And they're just like little envelopes. I'll probably keep um my little glitter stuff in them my little confetti that i'll show you in a minute um but they're gonna really come in handy so that i don't just have stuff laying everywhere but yeah so cute okay let's see next oh also for the shop so these are also oh, these are also from amazon these are um, sparkly iridescent wrap it, uh, wrapping and basket filling. It's just grass. It's like Easter grass that you get in an Easter basket. My mom hated it because it got all over the carpet. But I mean, it's so cute. How could you not want to just have this in your packages? I mean, I'll only put a little bit. It's fine. You know what's so funny is that my, my best friend, Jerry Ashley, she... I cannot stand glitter. She hates the thought of it. She's very much um, not a glitter person because she doesn't like the mess associated with it. And I, on the other hand, is like, give me all the glitter. I need it all the time. I need it. I need it. I just need it. So we are very opposite in that. But she keeps me grounded and lets me know when enough is enough with glitter. Although, let's be real. There can never be enough glitter. Um, so some other things that I got for the shop. Um, speaking of glitter, I did get these. So they were listed as nail art. Um, I guess confetti or whatever it is. But I thought it would be really cute to include in my packages. So I bought it. And it's just... It's just um, different glitter confetti there's um, moons and stars there's um hearts there's flowers there's more stars there's circles there's a little bit of everything uh so i'm just gonna go ahead and sprinkle this in with my orders also and then some other thing that i got was just these little confettis um, it says four unicorn parties, obviously it's for everyday life too. Um, and they're just like little tissue paper confettis, whoop, tissue paper confettis that I will throw in order. And those will all be packed in these Mylar bags that I think are so cute. I was so excited when I saw this lime green color and I knew that I had to them. 
haven't even taken them out yet. That package is definitely not for this. That's for this. We'll get to it anyway. I just like to take the stickers off the thing and put them on these packages that I'm going to throw away. Whatever. So, these are the bags that I got. This one is obviously bent. It's fine. But yeah, they're just these little Mylar bags and they'll fit perfectly um, as far as the earrings go with like a candy, some confetti, and then the earrings. And it's just the little zipper closure. So you will fill this up with some candy and some confetti and it's clear. And then I will take the little fabric bag that my palm earrings come in and I will just place it in there so that the glitter and the confetti and whatever else doesn't get onto the palms. Just in case, let's say it's, I live in Texas, so it's hot, let's say for whatever reason. I tried to get candies that would not melt, but for whatever reason, a lollipop melt. It's going to be safe inside another bag, so um, it won't get on the palms. So yeah. Those are the bags that I'll be packaging stuff in. Let's see if I can fit this back in here. Also, please forgive my quarantine nails. I haven't been back to get my nails done and they need it so bad. But it's okay. They've grown so much. I'm so proud of them, honestly. Like, just look at them. But don't look at them because they're chocolate. Okay, so I think that's it as far as my orders, um, my stuff for the shop that I got. Um, so then we'll move into this big mama. So actually this tub I got at the 99 cent store because I um, bought some um, Epsom salt um, soaks at, I want to say it was Big Lots when we first moved a couple of months ago. Um, I got some Epsom salt soaks and we I realized that we didn't have a tub or a container to soak our feet in. We had literally nothing that was that would work for it. So I saw this, it was, as you can see on the sticker, it was $2.99 and it is 24 quarts. So that's enough for me. It's actually a baby tub, but my feet and my little babies now. That's weird. Anyways, let's see what else we got. Um, so I got these at the Dollar Tree. I've been wanting some incense for my room, but I wasn't really um, wanting to go out and get a really nice incense holder and like um, sticks if I didn't know if I was going to really like them if they were too smoky for my room. Um, but... They had these at the dollar store, so I am going to try them. And they have a really cute little holder. It just sits there, and then the incense sticks out this little hole. Um, but yeah, so I will try these. They are rose-scented and enchanting aroma. So we'll see how that goes. What else did we get? At the Dollar Tree, I also got this little magnetic um, notepad. It says, you're a peach. They had some really cute ones there. They had different stuff. I think there was one with a little bike. There was one with little cacti. Um, they had a bunch of different ones, but I really need to try to like take notes and keep track of stuff. And I think that a magnetic notepad, especially on the fridge, because I can never remember what groceries we need and I'm often too lazy to go into the fridge. So this is helpful. So another thing that I got this week was a really cute note from my friend Jen. Um, she sent me a little letter in the mail and it was really cute. She decorated this little card and I won't read it all to you, but I'll just show you. She drew a little picture and it was really cute. So I decided when we were out that I would get her some stuff. So I decided while we were out that I would also grab her some little things to package and put together and mail to her. Um, so I got these at the Dollar Tree and there's little fox fuzzy socks. She really likes foxes and fuzzy socks, so that's perfect. And then I found these socks. 
and they have little rainbows with clouds on them and they're so cute and then they come with another pair that are striped with just really cute colors so i got those for her and um, she also really likes little hair clips so i found these little pom-pom um hair clips that are really cute so i got these in emerald green and i got them in mustard and i think she'll really like those and they'll look really cute on her and I think that's all I got for her from there. Um, and then on other things cute friends send you, I had gotten this picture and Regina didn't want to give it to me at first because she was going to keep it, but I really wanted it and she drew another one. So she gave me this one because I love it so much. It's just this little, this little substitute teacher lady. She's so cute and I needed a frame for it. So I found one at the Dollar Tree and now it sits proudly next to my little strawberry on my windowsill. Um, but I'll show you guys that. I'll insert a little clip of it here. What else did I get? What else? Oh my god, I got these from the 99 cent store and I'm so excited for them. I think I'm going to put them on my little windowsill also. They're just these little mushroom guys. And I got a red one, a brown and yellow one. And then this one is like yellow with brown on the top. They are so cute. I think they're ceramic. I don't know. They're just really cute and I love them. And I'm obsessed with mushrooms. And then at the 99, no, at the Dollar Tree, I actually got this little seashell trinket and she is so cute and I love her. I'm kind of undecided if I'm going to leave it white or if I want to paint it. I don't know. It's really cute and I think it would look cute either way, but I need it to have it. And then on the same shell note, I also got these little iridescent um, seashell plates and I love them so much. I should probably do this because I don't know if you can see any of what I'm doing. They're so cute and they are for trinkets or whatever. I think I might put one on my windowsill and then like one in my bathroom or even maybe one on my little vanity but they're really cute and they reminded me a lot of the Animal Crossing um, mermaid um, dressers and beds and everything right now um, and so I needed Also, just got a pack of trendy those because are you okay, Trumpa? Okay, sorry. I also just got a little pack of trendy those because I needed them. Who doesn't? Who doesn't need them? Oh my god. Okay. So also at the Dollar Tree, there's yarn now. Look at these cute colors. I'm obsessed with them. Like. Can we take a second? And these are a dollar. I pay like four dollars for one, probably twice this size. So half off is way more than enough for me. They're really cute colors. I've already made a pair with them. Um, I don't know where it is, so I'm not gonna show you right now, but they're really cute and I love them. And I'm probably gonna keep going back to the Dollar Tree for my yarn now because what a deal. What a deal, what a steal. And this cream color is to die for. And then lastly, I got some little candles. Um, this one is Moonshine Dust. And I really wish that you could smell all of these because they smell so good. They're very tiny, which I know is why they're there, but they smell really good. This one is Suede and Amber. It's delicious. This one is Eucalyptus Citrus Mint. Oh, that smells so good. And then this one is Pink Mahogany. I really like spicy kind of musky scents, but um, I also like fresh scents, so. But yeah, that's it. That's all I bought at the Dollar Tree. I, I'm the 99 cent store. 
I really would like to go again when they get new season stuff, but I don't want to go to the store too much because it gives me anxiety being out in general. Um, so I hope that I'll get to go again in the next few months or weeks or whatever, whatever. Everything's crazy right now, so it's whatever we can figure out. But yeah. to also take kind of behind the scenes um footage of what it looks like from my end and what i had to set up to get like certain angles or whatever so i have it set up on a little box in my messy room i was making palms so there's um string and yarn on the floor that i will sweep up but yeah this is this is my setup and this is trumpa sleeping Hi, Shampa. Babe. 